Right guys, welcome back to another video. I'm gonna to try to do this all in one take. Um, actually no, I'm not. I need to edit a clip in here. So yep, yeah, this is gonna be another 1080p video. It was gonna be 4K. Like I am recording it in 4K now, but you know, this I have a Panx Delta Bell X to demonstrate here. It's got it's got no light box though. I actually thought this was a Panx Delta Bell E. We've got a Delta Bell E. Yeah. So it's a Delta Bell X. It just doesn't have the light box. I will show you this i'll show you the inside this bell box is pretty much brand new it's not been installed wrong at all so we have the insides um you know 24 networks and security branded um twin piezo is that the warranty expiration june 2023 this still has warranty. If there was a fault with this, I could actually probably get a replacement. <laughs> See, look, it is the Delta Bell X, and it gladly says there, Delta Bell X mod. Yep. It's the Delta Bell X, not the E. I thought it was the E, but it isn't. It really is the Delta Bell X. Now, I'm going to test this. And excuse my janky wiring. I actually do know this works already. So spoilers if you wanted to know it didn't work. Of course you thought it worked anyway. These wires are janky though. I'm not I'm gonna have to hold it in place. Ow, ow, okay. Uh, jankiest wiring award goes to. So as you can see, the comfort LEDs are alternating. Looks very nice. It goes into my supply here. Once again, very janky wiring. But yeah. I'm gonna do a quick test anyway because these don't test take long at all. So three, two, one. There's your test. Now I did actually do it for quite a bit there because this siren's actually really quiet. Um, I did have to rewire it back up though because the piezo was actually cut with scissors instead of actually unplugging it, which is really stupid. I did disconnect the backup battery. At least I know that for sure. The next video will be me demonstrating my Parrax Enforcer system. The problem with it is, though, why the video will probably be delayed is because this thing is engineers locked. I don't know any of the codes or anything. So yeah, I did. I do have it set up ready though. Like I've got the I've got the panel there. Can I even zoom in at all? Right there we go. I had to actually come out the camera. So yeah, I can zoom in now. I've got um, a KXPIR up there. We're having trouble detecting me for some reason. And I've got one at the other side of the room as well. Why did it not detect me? I don't understand. And uh, I've got two spare PIRs here. One with the pet sink thing on it. And then the other one doesn't. That one actually doesn't work. I think it needs a new battery. <laughs> they really not detect me i mean they, i mean i know the wireless ones have a bit of a thingy for sensitivity but this is ridiculous i've just put new batteries in these yeah you get the picture i'm gonna be making oh and yeah and here's the bell box here which actually is working I mean, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna go too depth into it because obviously this is a coming soon video. But I think if I do tamper here, oh, okay, there we go. Yeah, the panel's going off. Yep, yeah, so it def so it is working, but I can't reset it now. It's just stuck going off. This would be really loud, but I've disconnected this piezo here because it literally is ear deafeningly loud. See, tamper alarm. That's the Delta Bell. Yeah, there's a coming soon video for you. I've got two GC boxes now. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Peace.